हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू शोर ऑफ सर क्लासेस सो टुडे द क्वेश्चन इज अबाउट चूज द करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट अबाउट बायो इंसेक्टिसाइडिस सो इट इज अबाउट बायो इंसेक्टिसाइडिस ओके सो हेयर द स्टेटमेंट्स आर दैट प्रिडक्ट बाग इज यूज टू कंट्रोल शुगर कैन लिव होपर इन हवाई second is bacillus papillae and bacillus lantimorbus mixture is called doom and c is both a and b and d is bovarian is an effective bioinsecticide is against citrus rust mite and answer will be option d why i'm telling you this bovarian bovarian or we also can call it bovarian that is obtained from obtained from fungus that is fungus that is named as bavaria that is bavaria basiana basiana so this is the fungus from this bovine bovarian is obtained now this is used for controlling the cholera do potato controlling the cholera do potato beetle and coding moth coding moth so this is clear that bovarian is effective in bioinsecticides so answer will be option d now moving to the next question now in this question this is about a somatic hybridization so the question is about somatic hybridization and we have asked given below are few statements there are also statement regarding this somatic hybridization and we have to choose the correct statement so let's see which are the statements here that is protoplasts of different cell of same plant that can be only fused okay that is wrong second one is protoplast from cells of different species can be fused yes that is the correct one okay now let's see see that is treatment of cells with cellulose and pectinase is mandatory that is also correct and option d is both b and c so it will be option d the correct answer because these are the combination of the correct statement now let me tell you one thing that somatic hybridization is there are suppose two protoplast or this is of two somatic cells of two variety or two species suppose this is species 1 this is species 2 and when we fused them together with this pectinase pectinase and cellulose cellulose then we get a hybrid cell that is we call somatic hybridization somatic hybridization and this hybrid cell contain the characteristics of both the protoplast they contain this and these two means if this is p1 and this is p2 this hybrid cell will have p1 p2 both the characteristics so here this will be the correct appropriate answer for this following question now moving to the next question 
Okay, so this question is about a tissue culture or micro propagation. Tissue culture or micro propagation. This we have to now consider the following statement which of them are advantages of tissue culture and micro propagation. So the options are here large number of plants that can be grown in short time. Yes, when we do cell culture when we do cell culture then that is we do in large number for large number production we for this large number production we only do this cell culture or tissue culture that is also called as micro propagation now this is the right one and this is done in very short time compared to the other procedures now disease free plant or disease resistant plant that can be developed from diseased plant yes we do this cell culture only for to disease to make disease resistant plant resistant plant and that can be developed from disease plant from the disease plant only we make disease free or disease resistant plant that is an advantage okay now the th is seedless plant can be multiplied we use seedless plant and then we let them to grow or multiply to grow or multiply this seedless plant and this is also right so all of them that is the option D will be the correct answer for this so thank you for watching this video